All right, so I want to thank everybody for coming, and I want to welcome everybody to the first ever Boys and Girls Club Kindness Conversation. So this is a collaborative effort between the Boys and Girls Club of America and Planet Fitness, where we're make, trying our best to make the world a judgment-free planet. So we want to encourage an area where uh, teens can really voice their opinions, their perspectives, and uh, voice their experiences with their peers and become, become agents of change. So we want to make the world a bully-free area where everybody can really uh, be themselves. As well as our moderator, uh, who is also an activist and author and educator, uh, Valencia Clay. This is what we're working on today. I don't want to talk too much. I want to hear your stories. So they asked me to tell a story about kindness, and I'm going to tell y'all mine at the very, very end. Because my stuff is irrelevant. Today is about you. But everybody in here is not always, how do I say this, comfortable with being vocal. So you have some books in front of you. And I'm going to give you a choice today. If you know you are not going to want to share out loud, you have to write in the book. Now, if you will want to share out loud, and you're like, I just want to share out loud, I don't feel like writing, then you don't have to share in the book. But I really do want everybody to have a book because I want y'all to do what I do. So this is mine. And I already have mine in here, and look how cool that looks. So basically, you're going to walk home with an already started journal. Yes, I am trying to sell you right now on why this is important for your life. So yours is going to look like this. And I brought an example. This is a smaller version of what you're going to have. But if you don't have anything like this right now, where you're just writing to be writing, not just writing for school, because you're always going to be writing for school, but just doing your own thing, then you need that. How many of us ever get an attitude? Just raise your hand if you ever get an attitude about something. OK, cool. Now, my question to you is, what do you do when you feel that attitude? Popcorn out. Right. I just stop talking. You stop talking, you listen to music, you shut down. See, that's what most people do. They either shut down or they lash out. What do y'all do? I do both. You just try to calm yourself down. See, this is the way. 